All right, we are at the season finale of Peaky Blinders season one. Luckily, these these are uh, these seasons are like super short, so we can get through it uh, faster than we normally would. But um, yeah, a lot a lot is going on. A lot. Once again, there's a lot of things that can go wrong. I, I know the the inspector. He he is the linchpin that can screw all of this up. Because all he got to do is walk in there and say, this, this, and this, everything falls apart. Especially when when dude just put all his trust in the chick. And she does care about him, but this could undermine all of that. And then he might be second-guessing things, and, and then she's expendable after that. Because, you know, he'll, he doesn't really have a problem with offing somebody. And if he thinks he... If he thinks she betrayed him, she at this point is kind of like on some kind of line. She's at this line where she quit, but um, the inspector kind of like don't want to give up. Yeah, because he because he's in love with her, right? And he knows that she's with him, mm -hmm. so he's gonna try to screw exactly. that up. Exactly. So she's on this fine line of getting exposed mm -hmm. to you know Thomas that you know. And he, he like, you know, develop all that trust into her. Mm -hmm. And, you know, she wants to be, you know, she wants to end her thing and kind of be loyal to him. Because I think, she, you know, she obviously like likes this guy mm -hmm. and stuff. But if he finds out that she's a, you know, a traitor at this point. Yeah, it's going to be bad. It's going to be bad. I don't know what and dude expected. <laughs> like, as soon as it was done, he tried, he proposed immediately. Especially when they never even had that kind of energy. Like he always seemed like a father figure or Dude, like, or uncle or something, and then he's proposing. I'm like, this is not gonna go well. And she's like, ah. And as soon as he found out who it was that she was in love with, then he mm -hmm. he threw the whole deal out, and then and, and yo he <laughs> now he's wilding out, and now it can it can it can get real bad. <sighs> this this show is just like. So much going on. Every yeah. every episode is a movie. It's yep. literally like a movie. A stressful movie where mm -hmm. you you're wrapped up in a ball and don't know what's gonna 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 happen. Anybody can die, a hat can come off, and when mm -hmm. hat come off, then it's it. You gotta cover <laughs> your eyes because <laughs> it's gonna be bad. I I think one of the biggest things is like finding those guns was just Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I didn't think it was gonna be there. Yeah, <laughs> like I was like, oh yeah, okay, you know, she thinks it's there, but it's not. And no, it was all there. I thought it was gonna be a one. setup. Yes, exactly. Nope. But they were actually there, yeah. except for one, except for one gun. That one gun that's still in the back of my mind. I'm like, mm -hmm. is that gonna be the thing to 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 do some damage? I don't this know. Is one season. <laughs> yeah, first season. One season. Oh my first god. First season. So <laughs> it came out swinging. Mm -hmm. All right, but here we are at the finale. Let's see what the hell's going on. Ready dancing. <laughs> I haven't seen them in a, since the beginning. Mm -hmm. Uh oh. What is what is he doing here? He's on the way out, so he's gonna try to do some damage before he leaves. Is he thinking they're hiding there? I is, I'm given to understand by several of my officers, several of my officers that people come here, that men come here for. A certain purpose. Uh, We're doing it today. <gasps> Black oh Star? Black boy. Star? Fetch the wagons, Charlie. It's today. Moves up the timeline. I'll be there in a minute, mate. <laughs> I've told you to keep the doors locked. It could have been anyone. Let none get hurt. And make them that do, not Shelby's. Damn. Watch Arthur. Because he's as likely to hurt himself as anyone else. <laughs> I know how he is. But he does what he does for us. Aww. I think. <laughs> <laughs> After today, there'll be no need for prayers. We'll be set. Family meeting. After. I, I didn't sleep last night. Oh, <laughs> it's one of those places. Mr. John said that you're a special, special customer. Maybe this will get his mind off of her. I mean, that's a better way to go about it than uh, trying to blow up the spot. <laughs> mm. I thought he was going to do that. Got to get his mind right. Do you want to take off your boots? Yes. He looks very uncomfortable. He's got to unwind a little bit. I didn't expect something like this from him, but... We can also clean and press your shirt while we do this. Oh, that's a very efficient service. 
<laughs> Sometimes old men who lost their wives, they come here all the time. Old man, I'm so old. No, I mean, I am young. I'll make you young as well. That's a pretty cool shot. Mm hmm. What's she doing? Oh. That was aggressive. Uh huh. Dear Grace, I write this letter to you with a heavy heart. I know exactly what you did and with whom. It is disgusting beyond all measure. Your father would be ashamed of you. You have betrayed every principle and standard of honor. And for what? <laughs> Love. Love, that's what she said. <sighs> Jesus. Oh my God, I'm sorry. Did I do that? It's okay. You're a special, special customer. Would you sit with me for a moment? Please. Not after you did that? No. It's curious, Inspector. I thought you came here to clean up the city. Not to sleep with its whores. I have a meeting with Mr. Winston Churchill at midday. And no doubt he intends to congratulate me on finding those stolen guns. And you still don't know how we found them, do you? Uh-oh. Before the day is over, your heart will be broken. Oh, uh, he's planning on... Yep. Mm. He's gonna out her. You forget, Inspector. I have my family. Enjoy your day. Oh, boy. That was a threat. Well, you never knew my children, did you? I was a child myself then. You never talk about them. Heart breaks even when I think about them. Mm. Sally was three. Michael was five. Well, they took my children from me. They never told me where they took them. Jesus. Because Tommy won't let them walk all over us. Now it is Tommy that has brought strength and power to this family. You have to be as bad as them above in order to survive. I'm telling you this because I want you to forgive him. How can I? When my Freddy's rotting in jail because of him. There's something about today you need to know. Oh, does that mean he's... Are they trying to break him out? Maybe? No. Maybe. You're not going to get as far as Brixton Prison. And you're free. Just say so he was free. Mm hmm Does she deserve some kind of commendation? A truly loyal servant to the crown. And that that's is what probably, the record should state. That's probably a bad thing. It's going to come out that she helped and... See, I have plans for the Peaky Blinders. Oh, God. Oh, my God. He has... This is the day we replace Billy Kimber. This okay. is the day we become respectable. The day we join the official National Association of Race Course Bookmakers. We do the dirty work. Everything's going down today. Oh. We're going to the Worcester races. Track opens at one, we get there at two. Now, Kimber thinks we're going there to help him fight the Lee brothers. I interrupted mm. those efforts this morning, and uh, I can assure <laughs> you all, John is making great sacrifices <laughs> in the cause of peace. <laughs> that inspector's going to screw all of this up. I'd like to introduce the newest member of the Shelby clan. Oh, OK. Aww. We named him Carl, after Carl Marx. Carl oh, bloody Marx. <laughs> Let me get a look at him. He looks just like me, look. <laughs> That's his arse looks like you are. He's all right. Thank you, Tommy. Oh, so maybe they were going to... Mm. Told me to volunteer for this. Peaky blinders. Mm. Tommy, Tommy, Tommy. Yeah, so maybe it was him then. What? That that got him booked in a in a plan to get him out? I don't know. I still think it could have been a chick though. Mm, I it can't be. Hmm? I don't think so. Yeah. He got beaten up like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He definitely saved him. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. But as far as putting him there, it has to be her. Yeah. But he's so calculating, he could have had him locked up because with a with a plan to get him out anyway. Mm. I'm waiting for the <laughs> Yeah. As soon as those hats come off, I'm leaving the room. Get out of the way. Oh shit. 
Oh, that's part of the plan, okay. Danny, you're dead. Nah, I've been living in London. <laughs> Same thing. Oh, there you <laughs> yeah. go. He came hey, back. He's back. <laughs> Next family meeting. I'll make sure you're there. Oh. If I were family. We'll talk about it more when I get back, all right? You wait to get home for me. What time do you call this? She, I think she wants to tell him. When you come back from the races, I won't be. I'm going to close down some of that other stuff. Maybe open a club. <laughs> hey, I'm in London. I am going to make a success of it. I am. I know. I know. I've done something terrible to you. Right. Tell him what you just told me. I said there's two vans driving up the Stratford Road. An old corporal of mine said he recognised some of the men. He said it's the Kimber boys. Okay, she's trying to tell him. Yeah. It's just us. All the ladies are on the way to Worcester. We're outnumbered. But who else knew today was the day you were moving on, Kimber? I mean, you said you kept it a secret. Who else did you tell? That barmaid. She didn't say. Mm -mm. No. But, I mean, she said I did something horrible. Yeah, so she so. thinks he thinks that. Tommy knows as well. Turned out that copper is good as told him this morning. But I wanted to hear it from your own lips. I am an agent of the Crown. I have the power to arrest and the right to use force. So please, step out of my way. Like I say, instinct's a funny thing. You fell for Tommy for real, didn't you? I'll fight you with my fists and show you how a rich girl fights. I'm from a tough family, too. We women have more sense. Why don't you pour us by the drink? <laughs> What's going on? Right me now? neither. <laughs> I think he'll try to kill me. It's too soft. Soft? Soft. You saved his life the night the coppers came. That's why we're drinking, not fighting. Hmm. What was he like? Before France? He laughed. A lot. He wanted to work with horses. Nah, not a single man came back the same. Yep. I will never forgive you. Or accept you. Or take you in. And it's me who runs the business of the heart in this family. You're a snitch from the parish. And if you're not gone from this city by tomorrow, I'll kill you myself. Damn. Maybe what really upsets you is the thought that one day you might lose him. Yeah. Mm. Fair. At least she's still alive. I like that respect, though. It's like, you yeah. save Thomas, I'm going to let you live. Yeah. But if you don't... But you got to get the hell out. Mm -hmm. And who told the police? You know what, John? For all I think I'm the smartest one, I'm guessing it was me. They put two and two together fast. Things have changed. We fight them here today, alone. Now, they're going to come for the pub. They're going to try and break us up for good. And we'll have no help from the Lord today. That pub there is called the Garrison. Well, now it really is one. And it belongs to us. Right? Good! Right. So I reckon we're outnumbered three to one. Damn. I know you vowed to God to never pick up a weapon again. But can you ask him from me if you can help us today? God says he don't deal with small heaps, sir. Good man. <laughs> Danny Shelby man dies here today. You better your side by side. All right, we've about 10 minutes. Make your peace with whoever. All right, damn. And when all officers and constables stood down in the following areas, Borders Lee, Small Heath, Chardin, Greet, and Hay Mills. Stood down, sir. Immediately. And the vehicles approaching the city should not be impeded. What the hell is going on? Let the beasts devour each other. And then we shall pick the bones. Of course. Mm -hmm. I told you, on the way out, he's going to do the most. Everybody around here, they, they want you to win this battle. Will you go looking for her? She's in the past. The past is not my concern. The future is no longer my concern either. What is your concern, Tommy? The one minute. Oh, boy. The soldier's minute. In a battle, that's all he gets. One minute of everything at once. And anything before is nothing. Everything after. Tommy, they're here. Here we go. Oh man, this is gonna be one heck of a. Mm. Whoa! Yep. Well, I like how they walked out like mm -hmm. that. Oh, piece of crap. Just shoot him right Whatever. in the head. Yeah. I hate him. 
Hold them up in the air so they can see what we've got. More guns and no balls, right, Billy boy? So what do we do now? Just give the order. He said the Leeds couldn't make it, right, where mm. they were or something like that. The men that have arrived in garrison line are armed with rifles. You don't care. Their methods of self-destruction are not my concern. I was sick of this force and I was sick of all the corruption. When you made that speech about cleaning this place up, I gave a little cheer inside. You said it was a devil's work to look through the way. I am not looking the other way, Sergeant Moss. I am looking directly at the events of the day. And I like what I see. Coward. Hmm, this, this is all because of the girl, too. You bit off more than you can chew, you little toe rag, and now I'm gonna take over this shit out. We have to use guns. Let's use proper guns. Uh-oh. Oh, he is that extra gun. Uh-huh. I told you that one gun. Hey, look who it is. Reporting for duty, sir. Yeah. Yo! You were saying something about being outgunned. That will mow y'all down. What are you doing? I believe you boys call this no man's land. Aza! Shut up and listen. Have you lost your mind? I said shut up! I've got brothers and a husband here, but you've all got somebody waiting for you. Now, I'm wearing black in preparation. I want you all to look at me! Who'll be wearing black for you? Think about them. Think about them right now. And fight if you want to. But that baby ain't moving anywhere. Damn. Ah! Oh, oh, Bitch. Ooh. Get off. Go home to your families. You thought you was invincible? Yeah, he's gone now. Go ahead. I'm so glad he's dead. Oh, but he lost the guy. Yeah. He died for real this time. Mm-hmm. Your plan did not work, motherfucker. Bastard. Tommy knows who I am. What did you say to him? That his heart would be broken before the day was over. You've broken two hearts, Grace. As well as my own. Punch him in the face. Oh, it. It. Oh. Hold him still. Oh, oh. oh shoot, he he got shot. Yeah. I don't. Know. I th I thought that first bullet went to the brother. I didn't know that oh, stay brave. Oh, oh. oh. it's gone. Yeah, rest in peace to this dude. That was a very improperly. It's hard on a hill. You like that? The actual grave that they yeah. made from. Stay, that's crazy. To Danny was bang. Danny. Uh, we all died twice. To Danny Whisper. A Mr. Uh, William Kimber has been found dead. A gunshot wound. Peaky Blinders won. Sir. Mm -hmm. put, that, put that back on. Mm -hmm. Since there were no officers on the street at the time, uh, following your orders, <laughs> prison officers said they recognised the men. They were. Peaky blinders as well, mm -hmm. sir. Yeah, there's more. I mean, we could go down there and make a few arrests, but uh, no one will have seen anything. And there were no officers there to witness. Uh... <laughs> you going not keep saying that because there was no, there was no officers. You failed spectacularly. No, I know. He's got sons. Should we find work for them? No, let him be. Let them find ordinary work, yeah. like ordinary men. Don't doom them to get caught up in yeah. this. He's still broken. Yeah. It's the one person he let his guard down with. I hope she tries to like reach out and just to see what happens. But she probably won't. She's probably too scared. Well, the, the aunt is going to yeah. kill her. Yeah. She, I mean, but she could be like in the shadows, but that's not really going to work. Mm, no. You know who I am? Circumstance is not important. <laughs> Circumstance. Is all it is. Here it comes. There it goes, Grace. Away it goes. We can say it as much as we like, but there's no chance. I'll be in London one week. This address. Finish your business here and join me. At least she tried something. 
Just gotta sneak past her. All of Kimber's men were busy here. So the Lee boys took all the pitches at the Worcester races. Oh. Shelby Brothers Limited are now the third largest legal racetrack operation in the country. So still got it. Okay. They, they had the contract thing, right? Or the license. They already had the license. To the others. All of them. You're all drunk. <laughs> like yeah, they, that guy went back yeah, to that they twisted. They've been drinking all night. <laughs> all day, pretty much. Dear Grace, without a secretary, I write my own letters. I have responsibilities here for people I need to protect and people who I love. I will give you my decision within three days. I want my love, Thomas Shelby. You're really gonna go out like that? What the hell? Yo, you ain't, ain't no way. Ain't no way. There's no way. Mm -mm. Ain't no way. He did not just do that. I'm not gonna believe he, it. He already called her out and everything and yeah. kind of told, why would yeah. he want to go kill her? What, what should he do now? It's like, I know you got your heart broken and all that though, but it, and you had, you had the worst day of your life. Yeah. The worst day of your life. And maybe he's gonna blame her for that because she was the catalyst that led to his downfall. There's no way he's just gonna go out, go ahead and go out and, and shoot her and make it even worse. Cause there ain't no coming back from that. But then again, he's a scorched earth type of dude. Mm -hmm. So who knows? I'm just gonna choose to believe that if we didn't see her die, she didn't die. Right, right. That's a right, crazy way to right. end the season and, uh -huh. and people gotta wait for the second season. So that's that's what you wanna end on. But there ain't no way. There's no way. I know he had the worst day of his life, but there's no way he's going out like that. But but he was recognized, though. Mm -hmm. Winston Churchill was like, oh, we, we're going to recognize you. Yeah, this. yeah. So he so, was like, I have my decision. I'm going to tell you what I want to do or something like that. I'm going right? to screw my whole life up. And he was like... That, that's the, I, I doubt that's what he said. Why would he want to go... Mm, I don't know. I, I, don't, I, I don't know. That can't happen. There's uh, no... Yeah. Uh, why would he want to go out there? I mean, sorry. Yes. Heartbroken, whatever. Mm -hmm. Blah, blah, blah. But... What does killing her, if he had to, or whatever he were to, what is that going to do? Maybe they, he sees that as the, the fix for, well, not the fix, a temporary Band-Aid. All yo. I know is we got to start season two soon. Because mm, mm -hmm. I'm marinating on this. I'm like, yo. Mm -hmm. So, expect daily texts. How they, how they, <laughs> I <say no. laughs> Season two. Hey, we watch this. We watch this. <laughs> Get ready. <laughs> This is a crazy Yo, ending to the season, though. Mm. I'm just glad that she actually reached out to to, to Thomas and and, mm -hmm. and and tried to reconnect because there's still love there, even with that. Like mm -hmm. he's never had that kind of connection with anybody else, as far as I know. And so I, I knew he wouldn't just like kill her. Like it, it's gonna take a while, but mm -hmm. there was actual love there. Duh. I mean, she she gave him, you know, her address and everything, yeah. saying I'll be here. Yeah. And she said, you know, and he said he'll, he'll write. I guess he'd write into her, or whatever. Yeah, he said. Give you my decision in three days. Three days. days. Yo, he. Mm. And then meanwhile, the inspector is, is is. That guy, man, it just gets turned around. Yeah. He was so cocky because he he knew he he had you know he's like they're gonna tear each other apart. I leaked it to them. They gonna kill each other, and we're gonna go ahead and pick the scraps. There's no scraps. Uh huh. Exactly. Oh, we found Billy Kimber died. Oh, no, no, no. Dude came in like, oh yeah, no, because the police weren't there, this happened. Oh, because the police weren't there, that happened. Oh, mm -hmm. and because the police weren't there, that happened. <laughs> 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 By the way, the police weren't there, so right, nothing happened. So it is what it is. Back to back to square one. It, All because it, the police it, it weren't there. It seemed like that that cop though, the other cop, like you know, is a good cop. Yeah, right. Yeah, he's definitely. like, I thought you came to clean up yeah. this mess as you promised, mm -hmm. and now you're in a sense is like, oh, now you you're corrupted it's just, it's too, or you're more whatever. the same. Yeah, like, like, you didn't change anything. Like, you didn't change anything, but I guess since you're the inspector, I have to listen to you. But see what happens. Oh, we found Billy Kimber. Mm -hmm. Guess who won? <laughs> Hello, like <laughs> because the police weren't there. <laughs> Damn. Yo. To have his plan fall apart so spectacularly 
That's not even egg on his face. That's the, yeah. He tripped into the whole carton. <laughs> <laughs> face first. <laughs> oh. Rest in peace, Danny. Yeah. Died twice. Yeah, Died man. twice. That, that's... Just, yes. Wow. You know, on the bright side, at least that was the only casualty, but, you know, that's that's we, there's still a casualty, so it's mm-hmm. not, you know... Not the happiest thing. I mean, he got shot, right? I mean, yeah. Palmer got shot right here. Yeah. A little bit of in his heart right there. At least that led to that dude getting shot in the head, because that's yeah. exactly what I wanted. Yo, I want him to get shot in the head. To be off <laughs> in the yeah. very first episode. The way he walked in, like, <laughs> yeah. huh? You, you, you got cocky like this guy, yeah. man. Yeah, I never liked him. I, everything, people. <laughs> everything about him just irked my soul. Mm-hmm. And I'm just glad he's, he's dead. Mm-hmm. Egg season two. Oh my god, I can't believe that. Great Ended first season way. of a show like that was wild. This, I, sh- this show is just. I cannot wait mm-hmm. for uh for season two. I know it's gonna be even crazier because mm-hmm. every episode here was a movie, and the the finale was wild as hell. Mm-hmm. Like, this a great, <laughs> great, great, great show. Great show. I can't say that enough. <laughs> great. I'm gonna wear one of those hats now. <laughs> but have no razors in it. No. You take that off as soon as you come in. <laughs> leave it at the door. <laughs> you can do what, Drew? You can do what? <laughs> take it off, I'm running. Give me a bottle of water. <laughs> what? <laughs> you ain't gonna give me a bottle of water? What? <laughs> you cut your hand, try to take the hat off. <laughs> it's like, darn it, Drew, I need a bit. I need a bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I, I mean,. I like her character. Nonetheless, you know, she she you know be, she had to do what she had to do. Yeah, okay. Yeah. She fell in love with Thomas and I mean, you know, he, you know, he fell in love with her for the most part and you know the aunt is not going to approve of it nonetheless. Hell no. She's not, but if she somehow saves the family again, like mm-hmm. somehow saves the family, I feel like she may just accept her. Yeah, yeah. As of right now, no. I mean, yeah, yeah she she saved Thomas, so she was like, "All right, I'm gonna give you a day ahead, yeah, before like, I kill you." But you get a free pass, the only yeah, one. Yeah, because she didn't, she didn't exactly do anything to cause anyone else to die. I mean, you I could remember. you could you could trace her telling the inspector. To do dying at the end because if well, if yes if he didn't know he wouldn't have leaked it to 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 them and they wouldn't have came oh, yeah, and well, and all too. of that so she was the kind of start of all of that mm. I mean she didn't directly tell them mm. but but you know she was reporting and he used that information to his advantage because mm. he he knew yeah that was that was kind of that was kind of guy's such a butthead yeah <laughs> but you know. She, Great, episode. She, Great season. Great yeah, season. she still actually loved him, and he knew that. So I was still, still just thinking about the very first episode. I had no idea what we were expecting. I had yeah. no idea what show this show was about. But like, yep. oh, Pinky Blinders, what are we Pinky Blinders? <laughs> 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 no, I want to be a Pinky Blinder. <laughs> I want to be on that team. <laughs> uh, it's like you know, family respect. You know, the love for each other and you know, protection of. You know, each other. He mm. came back from France after what he'd been through. Yeah, after the war. And yeah, and now he's like, all right, well, I even though I'm the second oldest, whatever, but you know, we are family. I will protect you guys. You know, mm-hmm. I'm gonna take everything. control. Yeah. And like you know, the oldest brother. You know, after last episode where he got you know pretty much his dad left him and all yeah. that. You know, it, it, he kind of just you know had to bring himself back together after yeah. that so when thomas was like you know what you're my brother we're gonna keep this you know equal or whatever three ways or whatever mm. like you know that's my respect for you right as an older brother because he does he just thought like you know he came back so i'm just like you know i went down the drain type of thing mm-hmm. <laughs> so i mean yo let's show this just just every little aspect of this show, like, you know, the way they built the characters, the way they built the storyline, mm-hmm. it's it's great. It's yeah. amazing. Like, it's like, I like the show a lot. Never thought I would like something like this. <laughs> <laughs> so serious or whatever, but yeah. it's just, it's, it's great. It's People just been great. trying to get me to watch that for years. Yeah. <laughs> I've never even heard of this show before. I'm like, oh, what's this? We're watching what? 
Okay, all right, sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, we came out 2013. That's over 10 yeah. years ago. Yeah. Yo, Killian Murphy's been uh, been playing a role since 10 years. Dang. Six seasons. That means they got they got to come out like almost every other year for another mm. season. I can see why. Yeah. <laughs> the, the amount of like drama in every single episode and the thought process of everything, I can only imagine. That's wild. 